Hey everyone and welcome to another SEO tutorial. This one is about Google My Business and the free holiday marketing kit that's coming out. So you may have seen inside of your email if you are checking the email which is associated with your Google My Business account, you might have seen this offer and I'll walk you through a little bit of it. And if you haven't got this offer, we'll see if we can find a way for you to get it. Okay, so inside of your mail it's gonna look like this. And of course you can scroll around here a little bit and take a look. Basically what they're gonna do is give you the ability to download a free kit that they create most of, of the artwork for, most of the graphics, right? We'll take a quick look here. You can see where you can print this out and actually uh, display it, whether you get that printed on cardstock or whether you put it into a poster type of thing. And of course they're showing where it's to promote the reviews on Google, so I suppose for a little bit of Google My Business, it's self-serving. Uh, okay, so obviously you can also make a post about it, but that's not what the most thing about is about. So let's go ahead and click on this where it says download your free kit. And it actually takes us to this page. It'll start a new tab for you. And I'll, I'll put the link in the description below just in case uh, you, you don't get this for one for yourself. And obviously you can see, you know, you can get the stickers, social, social posts and more. All right, so if we enter the business name, and in this case, we'll go ahead and put BT Foom. You there you go ahead and put in your own names, of course. All right, download and print. You can download that set. We can also see the, the personalized marketing kit and what they some other styles which you might want to choose. We'll go ahead and click on that just to see what we get out of it. Okay, so you can see that they'll they'll make them in the size for posters and signs, and they'll also make them the size for social media posts. You can change some of the backgrounds here, right, and use any of theirs. And we'll just go ahead and pick one just generically, and we'll say finish. Now we see the new backgrounds on there, and of course they're pulling this, right. They're pulling this from the content from the Google My Business. So yours will probably be different. This one will probably be real close to the same, right? Because Google's a little self-serving in the fact that they, they want to get their own push reviews out there. So yeah, you get to know that up front. And then, of course, there are social media posts. And here is another way that they are uh, self-promoting themselves, right? And you, you can't blame them for that, right? And they, if we want to re review your profile, but that's going to take you away from this kit. So, and that of course is going to take you to your social media uh, to have it shared. And we'll skip that as well. But we'll come back up here and we'll do these two things. Number one, we'll go ahead and say this this download. So depending on your operating system, you and your browser, you may get a different style of download. But it's it's going to be that simple that it comes and downloads onto your computer. So we'll go ahead and close that one. So that was the one for the window sticker. We'll scroll back down and here's the personalized marketing kit. We'll go ahead and say, again, pop up for what we want to save as. Unzip, right, and download, start, close. Okay, so what's going on? Really, this has come down on your machine now. Uh, you'll have to know your own operating system and browser, of course, where this goes. It may go into your downloads directory or it may ask you to specify where you want it. But then the key is to go ahead and get it and we'll go do that now. Okay, so here's an example of what these look like. You'll see that they're both zipped files, at least in our case. So yours may be the same thing. And if we go ahead and right click this and we extract it, it'll create its own uh, folder. And we'll do the same thing for the second one. And we'll extract. Um, okay, and then when we click on one to open it up, here we see that there are here is a tip sheet, of course, PDF. We'll take a quick look at that. Right, it's gonna walk you through some ideas of what to use these, and that's that's cool enough. Okay, so there's the tip sheet. Now, if we go into the different one, here's the for instance, that's eight and a half by 11, so that will go ahead and print on a regular uh, style of paper that you think of, an office paper. All right, okay, pretty cool. And here it is in a postcard size, five by seven and an 18 by 24. So really what they're providing you with is a set of PDFs uh, with your own custom background and the text 
course this is a little self-serving to Google as well right but it's not gonna hurt you either if you do get more reviews written from it that's great and if you can hang that on your front door or uh, obviously with a poster eight and a half by eleven or even if you're sending out uh, any postcards uh, handouts that would be a helpful thing so if you're challenged on graphics this may be a really helpful thing so let's go back and take a look at the other two okay so here we are inside the social media posts and what they've created are uh, 1080 by 1080 so they're square posts that you could use certainly for your social media so that's what's inside of that one let's go back Okay, and inside of the stickers and table tent, right, here we see uh, three more, uh, excuse me, four more PDFs. Obviously, this one is for the table tent and would have to be printed out on the appropriate cardstock. Uh, here are some others, the, the stickers, and of course, you would have to have the ability to get the, uh, the actual sticker depending on how you want that to look. All right, so let's go look at the next one. All right, so we're back to the Google My Business review, find, and book stickers. All right, gives you a nice set of instructions. So obviously you could send these out to a professional uh, print shop to get that, um, you know, that that higher quality rather than something that we can simply uh, do itself. But you know, if it's a limited bu budget, you could certainly go ahead and print those out with a high quality laser printer uh, that most of the printers are these days, and go ahead and you know attach them uh, whatever is appropriate there. So let's go back. Right, here we go. All right, book with us on Google, follow us on Google, and review us on Google. So not a bad thing for a free little uh, system. All right, let's go back. Okay, so let's go ahead and recap that. Inside of Google My Business, they are offering that free holiday uh, package that you can simply download. And just to summarize this, what's really going on is that Google is creating a little bit of the graphics for you, a little bit of the artwork so that you don't have to... Uh, spend your money to do that. So that could be helpful if your business is looking for this type of thing. All right, so here is the link, right? Marketingkit.withgoogle.com. And I'll put that link in the description below. Uh, so if we go ahead and go to that, even if we're not, uh, if we didn't get the email, you can still go here and this will work, right? You go ahead and you go ahead and enter your business name right here. And after we enter the business name, we'll go ahead and see the window stickers that are available for the business. And if we click on mail it to me, it will actually go ahead and say, right, limited one per business, confirm the mailing address, make sure it's the right place. Right, and then it's that simple. If we go ahead and say, yes, we want this actually physically mailed to us, they'll send it to us. So we'll click send. Right, and currently, as of December in 2019, looks like the backup or the expected time is about four to six weeks. All right, so that's pretty cool. And of course, there is limited to one per business, but that's a neat little add-on. Check in the description below. And if you'd like more help and to stay in touch, you can always become a member at btfoom.com and you can contact us if you have any questions, requests, and we'll be glad to help you out. Thanks, and I hope this helps.